night check here and I'm coming up to my 330s. So Wolverine. Dark one. Looks like a smaller female. Pretty. All the toes are accounted for. Which is good. Small. Nice and dark. Looks like a wolf came around the back. But didn't touch the wolverine, thankfully. He knows that trap is danger. Running the tundra tonight, there's a section that's just Ridiculous for overflow. Thankfully those wolves didn't touch this thing tonight. All right, I'm gonna get him out of the trap here. Well, he's frozen in. Load him up and continue on. This is the overflow I'm talking about. It's hard to see in the dark, but this is just a mound. And this is all overflow. Like, Probably a good seven feet high of overflow. Where I'm standing, my skidoo windshield would have been a month ago. I'm gonna try and go up here, cut a trail, but it's getting kind of late. <laughs> and I still have a lot of line to run. Whoa! All right, let's do it. I made it up that first part and I have no idea how I made it up the second part. The trail's down here. I just boogie down up here. Oh. Creator is on my side tonight. We have some lynx tracks going up the trail here. He's been following my trail for quite a while. And I have a 330 up ahead, so I'm... I'm hopeful. I'm hopeful we'll have him. Patient is high. We'll see. I have never ever seen <laughs> anything like this. <laughs> this is this is too much. So the trap, the box, the whole box was orientated on the tree over here. And this lynx, he moved the box with keeping the trap in there without setting it off. <laughs> That's so funny. I have never seen anything quite like that. Um, all I'm gonna do is just move the box back to where it was and maybe put a log on it. I don't know. I'm not too choked, but that's that's hilarious. Look, look at these, look at this lynx. He doesn't care. That's awesome. I'm actually glad that happened. I'm gonna remember that for a long time. Martin. Well, I'm on my, I ran the same line I ran yesterday with that overflow, uh, cause I saw a moose last night. I saw two moose actually. And I only had my 17 HMR. So today I have a moose gun. I'd like to get a moose, but I didn't, I, I scoured that lake I saw them at and I, they weren't, they weren't there. So I ran that line again. Now I'm running my other line. And on this line, a lynx also played around with a 330 milk crate. Which I find is bizarre. Maybe we'll get him eventually. Ah. Alright. Let's get a moose and let's get a few more of these. Look at look at this perfect catch on an ermine. I don't think I've Oh. No, I think it the trigger stabbed through him. No, no, it's good. 
<laughs> I've never seen such a good catch on this ermine. this guy out. Doing a night check. This is the big wolf I've been after for quite a while. <clears throat> I just uh, went moose hunting <clears throat> for seven hours and I, I saw three moose. <clears throat> Two cows and a calf. I thought I'd leave them be because residence hunters up here, they don't really care. They just shoot shoot they can. I try to contribute to some kind of conservation, but I think there is a bull I'm gonna try and get after tomorrow. But I'm glad I got <coughs> I got this wolf. I'll pull him out of the sleigh and I'll I'll take a better look at him. Look at that. He's a that's a nice that's a nice size there. <clears throat> I was gonna take a video, but I was just so exhausted from uh, from from moose hunting all day. So I'll pull him out of here. Found that bull, and there is a cow that just went into the bush. I might go look for her. That's good. This is the morning after from yesterday. Slay full of moose meat. Everything comes out but the guts. That wolf I got was right on a piss post. Right there. <clears throat> the night I got him, he uh he was all hung up on the drag right here. Didn't make it too far. That other spot I got that other wolf you saw in the uh, previous video. It's right there. But the the pee sets, they work really well. Every time they come in, they're going to pee there. And all I did was I, I took some pee. They pee all along this trail. I take all the pee and I pile it here. Um, and then I just have a little carcass there just in case. But I won't be able to check these every day because I'm going to be busy. Uh, Busy hunting for a little bit, so I'm just taking out some of my, my footholds. And it'll be good to give this place a rest. I've already pulled, uh, how many? Six. Six out of here. So, give it a rest, let more come in, because I know they will. I put a bunch more bait in. Give it a, give it a month. Let's do it. <clears throat> 